What's up, everybody? My name's Karibro. Welcome back to Pokemon Y Blind Nuzlocke Rewind. Just really quick, gonna check some stuff in the boxes here because I've got a new Mon that I want to check out the stats of. Those stats kind of suck. Actually, they, you know what? That reminds me a lot of Commander Cute. Now that I'm looking at it. But with less of a focus on speed and a little bit more focus on the defenses. Because you've got crazy high attack. But you're not a speedy type. And your special defense is not great, it's true, but it's it's not worse than Neoran. And you've got some evolutions probably to you as well. Alright. See about getting Pinchler into the party here. Drop out Turt. I say Turt because I'm going to face Caleb, alright? Uh when we get to the actual guys inside the gym, I'll probably get the weaker ones out again. But, uh, I'm gonna need Wolfric to deal with that, uh, fire type that he's got. Pinchler is just here as, like, for the EXP share. I'm not gonna... Well, mm, okay. I don't remember at all what he had. I'm gonna grab Ye. I'm gonna keep Ass.Ass .ass because Water and Ice is a good coverage to have. I think I'm gonna drop Dunce, and instead I'm gonna go for, uh, Mr. Licorice. Yeah, so I'll have the Mega Evolution of Mr. Licorice as like a super backup plan. And I got the Ground type and I got Scat Bat who can kind of hurt things and the EVO light gives you good defenses. I've got Ass.Ass .ass for water and Yay for just being like, yo, I'm a third tier level Pokemon, come at me. All right, heal me up, nurse. Okay, where's this gym at? I saw a cave up here. Oh, this is the gym. Oh, fuck, I didn't actually reposition anything. Sorry to keep you waiting. The reason I wanted to meet you is I wanted to see Mega Evolution in action. Where you use or not is up to you. But since I'm a Pokemon trainer, I want to know what things make Pokemon special. Cool. I thought I thought it would be on the other side of this. I'm not prepared. Hello, Caleb. How's it going? Sent out Meowstic. Is that a Mystic Meowth? Oh, it's this thing again. So, I don't actually know what's up with this thing. I was never able to figure it out last time. But Ye is a safe bet to put out first, so just, just confuse Ray it. Ow. The fake out did- that's the second time that's happened. In the last gym, the mean food did not react to my fake out, and this time Ye didn't react to yours. Like what- what- what is with that? Summary. Oh, inner focus which prevents flinching. That's all it was. Okay, cool. Well, that's really good on Ye then. And uh, since I didn't check it before too, Hyper Cutter prevents other Pokemon from lowering its attack stat. So it will keep that high attack. That means basically Pinchler is going to have to kill things before they kill him. Which I know is the point of all RPGs. But I mean like aggressively, don't attack me more than maybe once. Okay, well, I think I got off the confusion, so now I'm tempted to swap Mons. But I think I'll take out this one first, and then I'll swap next, depending on what it what it puts out. So air cutter it. So this Meow Stick, it has a ton of defenses. Like I don't know why it's so strong. Because both Bite and Air Cutter, watch, like these aren't gonna do a lot. Bite's super effective! I'm higher level than it with like crazy good stats and it only does that much. Although if it's... Does that mean it's part fighting? Dark is good against... Maybe it's Ghost. No, it can't be part fighting. Fighting is good against Dark. It's either Ghost or it's Psychic. I... With the name like Meowstick, I'm gonna guess Psychic. Alright, ass.ass .ass got a 34. Nice. Wolf got a 34. Good. Breaks in. All right, it's you. I know who I brought along specifically to deal with you. I could use ass.ass .ass too, but the uh, the fire is going to be neutral because of the ice. Oh, goodness. Okay. <laughs> Even your special moves can't scratch Wolfric. Spend every morning polishing this helmet to a gleany sheen. As I'm sure many men out there do. 
Stabam. I love that, like, I don't even need two boomerangs. Just one. Wolfric is that tough. And this is without a thick club. Scatty Bite got a 35. Sent. Ah, oh, right, you had an Absol. Forgot about this. Okay, Wolfric, again, probably still just the best bet to deal with it. You're dark and I have a fighting move. So I'm gonna focus energy. Like criminy, you hurt. Damn it. I can't thrash against something that does this much damage. It's just asking for trouble. So I'm gonna focus energy for the crit. I'm gonna spend a turn healing. With death super potion. And then next turn, I'll hit him with the Rock Smash. Rock Smash! At least you're not making me flinch. I'm happy about that. God damn it! Please stop! That was a crit. Great. It doesn't give me a lot of hope. But I'm gonna go for it. Rock smash, please don't fucking... Good, good with that dodge. That's my boy, Wolfie! Still bam Another crit, yeah! With the 1,300 experience points, Ye got a 33. Ye wants to learn acrobatics. I don't think I actually have Ye holding anything right now. However, Acrobatics is a physical move. Air Cutter is good on the crits, and it's a special. You know what, what am I even talking about? I have another move for uh, flinching. Get rid of Astonish. It's just, it's just dumb. Astonish is the entry-level ghost move. Kalem, you're down. <sighs> kind of forgotten how strong you are. How? It's been like 10 minutes. Damn it with the fucking opal! Even though we set off from Vanneville Town at the same time as a gap in our strength. Do you have something I don't? I guess I have to think about that. Yeah, three more Pokemon. Good luck with your gym battle. Okay. Let's go do another swap now. Grab some of the some of the weaklings back out for these uh for these gym fights. What you know what? Before I do that, I'm gonna check what type the gym is. Is it flying? It's got the color. Coomarine City Gym. It's either flying or grass. There's a lot of leaves, but it's also very high. How about a little sprout? You gotta figure it out. Old Man Ramos, the gym is all about grass. Okay, cool. So I'm gonna need uh, flyers and I'm gonna need chirbits, but maybe chirbits I'll hold on to for uh, the actual like end of it. Because Tribbits is already level 34, and I don't know that I need to burn the place down with Charizard. Okay, so, um, grass means that Aquaman is out again, unfortunately. Sorry. Uh, Peeble might be good, because I think grass, at least in the first gen, at the first couple of gens, it often came paired with poison. So, Scatbat is kind of tough right now. I think I could probably drop her if I needed to. Uh, Turt, you're out, because of the water again. Yay is almost needed because poison and grass are both, uh, poison and flying are both good against grass. Ass dot ass, I can drop you. For the, oh, but you've got the ice, so you're an option. I'll keep you down here for that. Um, Pinchler, I'm just keeping here for the experience, but there's no way I'm having you face grass types. Wolfric, you're out. Uh, Licorice, I think you're neutral to them and you're only 32, so I'll bring you along. Blet could come along too for fighting. And then I need somebody that's. Yes. And then I'll bring uh, Niran for another poison boost. Okay, cool. Yeah, and then Sherbets is level 34, so if things start looking bad, I'll come back and I'll get Sherbets. And with this crowd that I have right now, I've got. Niran, not great on the defenses, but it's something. Same deal with P Bubble. Actually, I don't really have any defensive ones with me except for Ye. How does grass work against ice? Would grass be neutral against ass? 
Grass is neutral to ice. Okay, so no, they'd still be super effective against ass. Dunce also needs levels. All right, I'm gonna run with what I've got right now just because... Nah, you know what? I want to put in Dunce in place of Pinchler since Pinchler is never going to see combat. I'm just leeching experience with this. But if that's what I'm doing, there's no point having him in the party. I can I can catch him up off screen if I have to. I want to have Mons that I can use. Dunce, you're with me now. Sorry, Pinchler. Catch up with you later. Okay, let's go give this place a shot. Who's going up first? I got... Let's get Niran up in the front line of the party. Just since I don't know what I'm facing. She's she's a pretty sturdy bet. Ugh. It's a... I don't like that rope grippy sound. It was, it was very, like, gehy. Behold, the power of green, the power of nature. Ha ha! Pokemon Ranger Chase. I'm actually in the, in the eco-military. <laughs> it's a thing I just made up. Simi Sage. So you're what the monkey of a grass type turns into, eh? All right. Your forehead appears to be on grass fire. I'm just gonna poison jab you. Shazam. Wow, that did a lot of damage. All right, so the first trainer I'm facing in here is 32. That reads pretty well for my levels. I'm above the gym, which means that uh, I shouldn't have too many issues. But I also shouldn't, like, out-level the leader by the time I get to him. That's some good XP right there. Where do you get your power? Tell me, so that I can go and uproot it and put it into my own personal Greenland garden. I'm not- I'm not thinking about anything else right now. Nothing else gets commented upon or stated until I face the next trainer. So that I can turn on this- oh my god, this waste of time. I'm thinking exclusively of the one thing right now. It crawls in my ears. Help. Where are the trainers here? Like, what's the point of- it's just a giant zigzag. It doesn't even do anything. There's a trainer. Okay, now, we're gonna go down to this thing. Not, not that. Go down to the this thing. I'm gonna hit this button. I'm gonna go there. And I'm gonna finally turn on my stupid powers. Prize money power. Use. Attack power. Use. And HP restoring power. Use. Bam. All right, let's have a fight. Come at me. Here to challenge the gym, are you? Let's see a Pokemons then. Shouldn't be too much of an... Okay, you have three. Good. This might actually be a challenge. Pharaoh Seed. Ooh. You look like you might hurt if I try to attack you. But you're also below 30 again, so... Who knows? Oh, you're steel, you son of a bitch. Maybe I can just bite you down then. Okay, bad idea. Cherbits would do very, very well here, but against a steel type, I think I gotta go with... How does flying do against steel? It's bad, right? Yeah. So, I gotta swap to licorice or blet. Maybe I could, yeah, blet could do it. Mr. Licorice. Mr. Li I, I gotta go get his name actually changed. I know I said I'm gonna call him Mr. Licorice, but I just read what's there. All 
All right, force palm. I should have fake out. No, fake out actually would have been a, would have, would have been a bad idea because I'd get hurt by the iron barbs for like not worth it. Uh, the amount of damage I would do to him. Jeez, that hurts. Knock him out. And I, and, and I have Fly now, so I can actually get back to the Nicknamer and do that before the next episode. Nice. Rest of your team got experience share. All right, Maurice sent out Lombre. You're a water grass. Pretty sure I remember that. All right, Dunce, you have a round here. I was thinking for a second and also tapping my lips to the, to the music beat. Hee <laughs> hee. Yeah, Lord Dunce has the HP to deal with this, and he has a rocky helmet, so perfect. It's Iron Barbs just on my side. Go ahead and glare at you. Just make sure you're wasting about half your turns. All right, dig. Might not actually be helping me to use Dig. Yeah, because if I just let you hit me with physical moves, my Rocky Helmet will do a bunch of damage for me. So, Ancient Power instead. And if I take damage, I can just Roost and get it back. Yeah, just like that. Use the Fury Swipes and take damage for every single hit. Oh, this is awesome. Just get your health back. Why not? Hopefully, if Fury swipes again. Nope, he's bubble beaming. Alright, fine. Just dig. Just dig and finish him off. Might have time to do one more uh, trainer battle in this episode. So that's two, right? Yes, you still have a Carnivine. Oh, there is a Venus Flytrap Pokemon. I was wondering if they ever decided to go with this. Nice. Is it flying? Because it's kind of floating above the ground there. I don't know. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to Ancient Power it. It's not flying. And you're going to heal yourself up every turn now, so that's awesome. And it's not glare. It's paralyzed here too. It's floating, which makes me wonder if it might have levitate, which would make dig not work. Then again, why bother waiting? I'm just gonna go over to uh, Nioran and have you poison it. I like that Nioran's like already bulky enough to take a couple hits. Gives me great hope for Needle Queen. Oh wow, that's more what I'm talking about. Yes. One more poison jab. We'll do the trick. Just suck you right in the face there, and the Carnivine goes down. Huzzah! for 1100 full experience very nice lord dunn's got some experience level 33 racer team mr licorice got a level 33 mr licorice wants to learn quick guard i don't know what quick guard does protects itself and its allies from priority moves i don't know any special stuff so metal sound seems like a waste but I don't know, like, what priority is that? Does that just mean the ones that goes first? Like, quick attack? Because that's dumb, if that's all it is. I don't know if I need to worry about that. That definitely seems like a more competitive move. Back out. Do not forget a move. Give up on learning it. Yes. Cool. Defeated Maurice. What excellent Pokemon you have! And... That fight ended up taking a little bit longer than I thought, so 
there will not be time to do another to do another battle but maybe i'll check down here really quick no wait that also leads to a battle okay so so there is some more stuff that can be experimented with and explored for next time this is, a, this is an interesting gym i kind of like it aside from the really creepy crawly rope sound that gets inside your ears like ugh. oh well that one's better anyways Thank you everybody so much for watching. Remember to hit that like button down below. Please do consider subscribing if you've not already. Remember to share it around with anybody you know who might like, be, might like or be into this kind of thing. And yeah, I'm still not sure if, uh, well, when I'm gonna hit the thousand subs mark. We're closing in on it. By this point, it might already be done. But it's been like waffling around the low 990s and I'm like, ah, just, just, just go. Just turn over, just roll over. I want to be there for when it happens. Anyway, catch you guys later. Bye bye.